My thanks to all of you for coming out tonight. Looking around the room, I see so many familiar faces, friends, colleagues, and yes, even a few old adversaries. But even after all of these years, we are still united by one goal, equal justice for all. Uh, while my time as chief will not come close to the 25 years Justice Kennison led the Supreme Court, I am deeply honored to receive an award tonight that bears his name. As many of you know, the walls of the Supreme Court courtroom in the very building named for Frank Rowe Kennison are adorned with portraits of past chief justices, the most beautiful of which is Chief Justice Broderick's. When I look out from my seat on the bench, I see Justice Kennison's portrait directly in front of me, well, maybe not directly, a little bit to the right of the door. And that means that during every oral argument, I am looking at him, and he is staring straight back at me. And then when the session is over, I take my seat at his desk, the Kennison desk, a very big desk. It sits right above the Supreme Court boiler. And it often vibrates so much that my Mr. Bill bobblehead nearly loses his balance and falls off the edge. I think that Chief Justice Kennison may be trying to communicate something to me. I'm not quite sure what except that he wants to shake me up and remind me not to get complacent. Chief Justice Frank Kennison is a constant reminder to me of not only the highest level of jurisprudence, but also the steady leadership that is expected of every Chief Justice. It's true, a Chief Justice can offer leadership and direction and sometimes even inspiration. But in reality, a Chief Justice is only as good as the quality of her judicial branch. In New Hampshire, we are fortunate to have a third branch of government filled with exceptional staff, administrators, judges, masters, administrative judges, and associate justices. Without their unfailing dedication, hard work, and high quality of character, no chief justice could shine, let alone be given the time or the opportunity to be forward thinking. It is the chief who gets the credit for all the advancements in the branch, but in truth, it is the justices and, st and staff who do the hard work for which the chief gets that credit. So, on behalf of the entire New Hampshire Judicial Branch, I humbly accept this award. And you can be certain that much like Chief Justice Kennison's portrait, it will hang in a special place where it can look right back at me every day. Thank you. <laughs>